Hey there, innovators, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, partly cloudy and rather cranky. That's the best way to put it for the aquas right now. The moon is transiting your house of karma, the 12th house, the house of subconscious, past lives, karma, early childhood. It's basically your subconscious programming in which the area where you store all those events, past life, karma, childhood. And with the moon there, it means your emotions are taking a tour of the subconscious realm, which means ultimately, if you feel angry, if you feel big bursts of emotion right now, they're more likely tied to past life or subconscious or childhood issues than they are to the present. In fact, during this transit, if you find yourself triggered by the present, take a good look at your inner self. 90% of the time, it's actually past life or past or subconscious resentment that you're emotionally processing. And the point of this transit every month is to make conscious subconscious emotional patterns. So pay attention to yourself. That's why you may be a bit cranky right now. Plus the moon is actually ruling the sun on top of that, which means that you're very sensitive in the arena of communication and a lot of this will play out in your communication. Also pay close attention to your self dialogue, your inner dialogue and how you talk about yourself and how you're emotionally reacting to yourself. This is where all really the spiritual growth is today and tomorrow. But I also want to point out another tension going on that's simultaneous and might be co-triggering this. Venus squaring Mars right now for the next couple of days. Now, Mars is in the house of self-esteem and abundance for Aquariuses. You've got a lot of masculine, aggressive energy online and available for you to go make money, to raise your prices, to feel better about yourself. It's a hunger, a masculine hunger to feel better about yourself. But that is in conflict with Venus in the house of home, family, and foundation. That means you might find some conflict or fear issues between really developing your abundance or developing your self-esteem and the way you were raised or the way you are currently living right now. So look for patterns between those two. It'll last for a few days. It's a tension and really ultimately you want both to be able to be happy. All right, Aqua, that's all I have for Tuesday. See you tomorrow with more Soul, Soul, Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. So God.